Hey guys, so today we are in Cambridge and right now we're just eating um, ice cream at the park. And we're planning to go shopping today. Um, because all the stores just open up like around the 15th. I know Primark opened up on the 15th. Um, and so we didn't really think much about shopping today because I was like, well, it's not like the first day they're opening up. But then I realized it's the first weekend that they're all open up. So it's probably gonna be even more crowded. But yeah, so we're just um, eating our ice cream right now in the park and then we're gonna go to the mall and hopefully buy like a lot of stuff. Um, and we're probably gonna look at bikes um, and pool stuff because we're hoping to get a pool. Um, I don't know about that though. It has not been working out lately. We no. ordered the first pool. Said it was gonna get here in seven, uh, 27 business days. Mm -hmm. Never got here. It's been way more than 27 business days. We have to cancel it. And then he just ordered a pool. And then it said order got canceled because of like something wrong with his um with our shipping address. I don't know. Anyways. It says the buyer canceled it. Yeah. Because there's something wrong with the shipping address, which I doubt because I put it in there perfectly. So. But. So, I actually don't know about buying pool accessories since we don't have a pool and we don't know if we'll ever be able to get one. <laughs> But yeah, we're gonna look at bikes um, and definitely lots of clothes because I've been waiting to go shopping since like lockdown started basically. So I bet we're gonna get like a lot of stuff. And what I didn't realize is that there are like lines to get into like every store. But yeah, so we went to a vape store and William got like a whole new vape and then lots of juice. And then we went to Poundland and it wasn't worth it for the hassle that we had. We, we literally had to have the cashier go up to us like six times to like fix everything that was going on. Yeah, and then we had to sign our card because it's a US card and then we just had a lot of problems with the self checkout thing. So it wasn't worth it because we literally just got like a whole bunch of random shit that's like candy and stuff. But yeah, so now we're gonna go to Primark, which is like the main reason that I wanted to come here, obviously. Um, but it's just like a really long line to get in. And William's hungry, I'm sorry. But I just really wanted to do Primark before we go get something. I was begging her to get something to eat before You're Primark, like begging. but. Begging. you. <laughs> Primark and I bought like literally so much stuff at Primark. It was like 55 pounds, which I mean actually isn't as bad as I thought since like Primark is the only store that I bought clothes at. Um, yeah, we went to the mall beforehand, but lots of stores were closed. Um, and so now we're just trying to figure out somewhere to go eat, but obviously lots of restaurants are closed and like the few that are open are pretty much just takeaway. So, or are you just gonna eat your M&M's? <laughs> Or do you want to actually still go somewhere? We could just go back home and go on base and get Taco Bell or something. No? I mean, to be honest, it's probably a great idea. Okay, but we do still want to go get bikes, don't we? Yeah. We'll yeah. Well, but Can't forget that. I just, I'm so. I miss burgers. So much. Burgers? Yeah. Aren't you going to look up a burger place on your phone? Yeah. Okay, cool. So we'll see if we can find anywhere to eat. Oh, it's on car directions. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so it's not even a six minute walk. <laughs> oh wait, no, that means it'd be more than a six minute walk. Can't you change it to walking directions? How? Click X. And then up there. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Alright, 11 minutes. So oh. That's, that's, that's a bit further. Alright. <laughs> so we got lunch at some place called Pepe's, I think, um, Piri Piri, um, and William wanted a burger, but he didn't realize that it had mayonnaise on it, so I had his burger, and I just ordered a fry, so William had two things of fries, so our lunch was kind of messed up, but... I really only had one thing of fries, because we had a lot left over. Yeah, we got lots of fries, but yeah, and now we're just sitting here eating Jaffa cakes that we got at Poundland, but they're like the Jaffa cake bars, which we haven't tried before. They are so much better than the cookies. They are pretty good. Yeah. Um, and so then we are heading to a bike shop here soon. Um, I wanted to go to a used bike shop, but most of those are closed. So I think the one that we're going to is like a new bike shop. So I don't know if I want to, if we want to spend like that much money on bikes, but we'll see. We just upgraded 
from the Aegis legend to the Aegis Zeus mm -hmm. at the, the vape shop in Cambridge. What, yeah. what was it called? What was the vape shop? Oh, it's called Time to Vape, like the Time number two. Vape. Yeah, we went there before too. They were really good. They, they were yeah. Really good. I guess Aegis is known for being sturdy or something like that. Because we've dropped ours lots of times. I know, and it hasn't broken yet, so. But yeah, I'm excited for this. So we just got home from Cambridge about an hour ago, and we did end up going to one bike shop, but the bikes there were like really um, expensive um, brands, and we were kind of looking for more like used bikes. Um, and we did plan on going to used bike stores, but they had pretty much all closed within the area, like as soon as we decided that we wanted to go head out and check out some bikes so um yeah we've been looking for bikes for like about a month now because that's definitely something that we wanted to do this summer was go cycling a lot um but i don't know we just had trouble finding them obviously with coronavirus tons of stores are closed um and also a pool you know we've had issues getting a pool and we really wanted to have a pool this summer um and now like by the time we get a pool summer will probably be over but we're hoping still to get bikes in a swimming pool um but we'll see so yeah we checked out that one bike store and then we came home um but i'm just gonna show you guys what we got at primark and poundland and like wherever else we went um real quick so the first thing that i got at primark was literally just this plain black cap for two pounds fifty um because we have like a lot of baseball caps but they're all like colorful and i just wanted one that'll go with like any outfit so it's pretty basic um and then i got this really cute hoodie is it yeah it's a hoodie but it's pretty light so i could probably wear it on like a bit cooler day in the summer um and it's actually a winnie the pooh hoodie and it says what does it say it says some people care too much i think that's called love and then we got this shirt for william it's a captain morgan shirt um because he, like, that's his favorite rum is Captain Morgan. And this was six pounds. Um, what else did we get? Oh, yeah, I got these sweats, um, which were ten pounds. And these are really cute. And I love, like, the little pockets on the sides. And we weren't able to try anything on because the dressing rooms are closed in pretty much every store still. Um, so I couldn't get any jeans, even though that's like the main thing that I want is jeans because all my other ones are too big for me now. Um, but yeah, so I got some like shorts and sweats and stuff because I don't think I really need to try those on because they're all like stretchy and stuff in case they're a bit too tight or a bit too loose, then I can just tie them up. Um, so I got these two pairs of shorts, one green and one blue, and they were each two pound 50. And then I got this Stockholm Sweden shirt um because we went to stockholm this is only two pounds fifty so that's really good and then i also got this london shirt which is really cute with the big ben on it yeah and it was also two pound fifty um oh i forgot about this actually i've been wanting a jean jacket like this literally for like years and years and years and it was only 15 pounds i believe yeah this bike back here and I'm so surprised that it could even fit in the back seat um, I thought I was gonna have to take the um, front wheel off anyways yeah I just picked that up in town um, from some guy selling it on Facebook marketplace because um, I looked last night once we got home and I was kind of discouraged about not being able to find a bike so that worked out well and then I'm gonna drop this off at home right now and then I'm actually going to um, pick up another one in Thetford about 40 minutes away um, and hopefully that one will fit in the back seat too. I ordered a, um, a bike rack for my car um, so that we can transport them, but that's not gonna come in until July 1st. Okay, so I got the second bike and it took way longer to get into the car than the first one. I'm pretty sure I was literally there for like 20 minutes trying to fit it in, but I got it. And um, I brought tools along to take off the front wheel if I needed to, which I did, um, but they were the wrong tools. So anyways, I figured it out.
Hey! I got bikes. You got bikes? I got bikes. I got two bikes. Actually, I'm missing them. Okay, they're outside in the Ooh. back. <laughs> okay. I know, I went to get bikes. They've been gone for like four hours. Gross. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, we got a gold one and a blue one. Yeah. Damn. And the guy that sold this worked at a bike shop and he said he like repaired all of it and stuff. And you can like adjust the seat and handlebars somehow on that one and I think on this one, yeah, but they specified that one can. Yeah? But I know that one can adjust. <laughs> That's not how you ride a bike. Oh my god. Do you want to adjust it? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Do you want to lean or do you want me to? You should. Okay. <laughs> I've not been on the bike in a long time. I am happy to have bikes. This was like an interview. I know. <laughs> so how do you feel? You got how do you feel about handlebars? <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> that was fun. I think We're we have exhausted. a problem though. Both of our favorite bikes are the blue one. <laughs> yeah. But neither of us really like mind the other yellow one. So I think we're just gonna like kind of switch off and mm. share both of them. Like, you don't mind the yellow one? I mean, I mind it more than you do. Yeah. But I'm still, I still want us both to have the bike that we want. So. That's right. You're right. Yeah. So I'm cool with just switching off on the bikes. Yeah, anyways, pretty decent bikes, and hopefully we can take them to a trail soon and ride them. Yeah, maybe next oh, yeah. weekend though, because it's be Sunday fun. already. Yeah, that would be fun. There are like quite a few trails that I found within our area within the last month or so. It's time to get fit again. I know. Like we just drove around, drove or rode around the neighborhood, and was rough. we were so. Yeah. Woo! It's probably not good. That's not good. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a good thing we got our bikes then. <laughs> I know exactly. That'll that'll help. Mm. Next thing is a pool. Mm. No guarantees that we'll actually get one, but we do have a lot of pool mm. accessories, so that's something. <laughs> fitness is important, guys. Don't uh, important, guys. don't lose Take track of your time. fitness. <laughs> don't go to Taco Bell every Sunday. Sunday. Mm, that's awkward. Wow, wonderful shots. Thank wonderful you. shots. <laughs> wonderful anyways yeah i guess we're just going to end the vlog here we had a really fun weekend in cambridge well i had a fun time in cambridge shopping william was just coming along what you didn't have fun though i mean with I the vape so shop fun. yeah i know not in primark that wasn't your favorite Ooh, but primark everything else rough. everything else you liked right yeah, yeah. i think all major <laughs> clothing stores like big brands should have a waiting room for guys to sit in some have and it'll have that, it'll honestly. have like an arcade with mm -hmm. like uh, i don't know like chicken wings and 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 games and stuff chicken wings yeah and and football yeah. playing and it'll just be like a man cave at the front of every every clothing store i think i've heard of that at like certain stores they're starting really? to have like a husband a husband waiting section. room or something well, yeah. then they're starting to get smart because yeah. that was freaking terrible you i was looking for a place primer. to sit down and there was none. Yeah, I think they took them away because of coronavirus, so. Ugh. They don't want people, like, sitting and still there. Yeah. I mean, the, the 
dressing room was closed, so I feel like there was, I guess there was no reason for mm -hmm. anyone to have to sit down. Except that you just in didn't want to shop for him. <laughs> they forgot about the, hus the, the husbands. <laughs> but yeah, the rest of the time, we had fun together and getting bikes today. So it was a fun, it was a good weekend. It was a successful weekend and a very expensive weekend. It was a long weekend. Can we have one weekend where we weekend. don't do anything? Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. That'd be nice. Wait, we always have weekends where we don't do anything. We've this gone out like three weekends in a row No, now. this was the one weekend where I was like, we finally get to do something. No, nope. we've gone yeah. out at least two weekends in a row now. We're, we've never gone anywhere. That's not true. The times you're thinking about where we've gone places was when you were on your two week breaks. Nope, not that. Mm -hmm. We went somewhere last weekend as well. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, it's doing it in the vlog. No, let's fight some more. <laughs> Over here. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Or just give us a dislike and tell us why you hate us. See, See you, you next time. time.